NASA's shocking discovery on Mars. What did they find? Mars has harbored humanity's hopes of being a habitable planet for quite some time. Scientists have discovered that the planet used to have many geological developments underneath its surface and volcanic eruptions on a massive scale. But what else have scientists found out about the planet? Stay tuned to find out. Before we continue further, I would request you to subscribe to the channel. Alright, so as discussed earlier, Mars had a huge network of underground volcanic eruptions. On its surface, Mars has the largest volcano in the entire solar system, which can be spotted even from a mediocre telescope on Earth. This volcano has been fittingly called Olympus. However, scientists have found out that these volcanic eruptions stopped a long time ago, and that the planet's core has dramatically cooled down ever since. Due to the drop in temperature, the core has solidified and has resultantly frozen the water supply on it. Scientists have discovered that Mars has become more active recently, according to the images of the equatorial region of Mars. These images were taken between 2006 and 2020 by the Orbiter Reconnaissance Program of NASA. Orbiter took these images from a height of 300 kilometers. The images obtained allow us to distinguish objects of up to 1 meter. Scientists were able to spot a huge number of landslides on the slopes of Martian volcanoes. Scientists have analyzed the rock traces left in the wake of these landslides and identified more than 4,000 traces of such rocks, which are normally associated with a strong earthquake. The biggest trace of these rocks is about 2.4 kilometers long. Most of these traces could not be identified in the pictures taken in 2006, leading scientists to believe that most of these traces took place after 2006, which is evidence of active geological phenomena taking place on Mars. These geological phenomena are speculated to be strong tremors, since only strong tremors could move these big stone formations in the way latest pictures showed them. Scientists have been monitoring the seismic activity of Mars since 2018. They found out that since that time, Mars has been rocked by about 1,300 tremors, which amounts to nothing when compared to the number of tremors recorded on Earth, which could go as high as 1 million tremors. Additionally, these tremors are quite weak, and the strongest of these tremors was reported to be only about 4.2 on the Richter scale. In 2022, the Red Planet recorded an earthquake of 5.0 magnitude, which compared to the seismic activity on Earth is considered of moderate intensity, but was quite a significant event for Mars. What do these seismic tremors indicate? This shows that the inner core movement has not ceased and that magma continues to erupt, which is causing the bending of the single lithosphere tectonic plate of Mars. We also know that the planet has a very harsh environment with almost zero reserves of liquid water. We have also not spotted any animals, but microorganisms cannot be ruled out. Microorganisms are tough and can endure tough conditions. Also, the presence of subsurface lakes on Mars suggests that microorganisms can thrive under the surface of Mars. We have recently discovered a huge underground lake in three smaller water bodies through the Mars Express Orbiter. The lake makes for about 75,000 square kilometers, and in an addition to smaller water bodies, there are also reserves of ice on the Valsmarin Canyons. Scientists have theorized that there is an intricate canyon system running along the equatorial boundary of the planet, which could be as big as the Netherlands. Moreover, these canyons are located close to the surface of the planet. Comparable subglacial lakes have harbored fishes, microbes, and other aquatic life. But can the water located in the lakes on Mars contain life? Scientists are trying to find an answer to that question by determining the composition of the lake. If it contains salt in excessive quantities, then even microbes will not be able to survive. Another clue to life could be found in the form of organic material. Perseverance rover in 2022 found organic matter near Lake Merger. This lake was formed through a delta created about 4 billion years ago, and had resulted in accumulation of sand, dirt, and different salts over time. The analysis of the organic material has indicated the presence of hydrogen and carbon, among other elements. These elements were combined with sulfate deposits, which could help in preservation of organic material. A detailed analysis about the origin of these elements can only be made once these samples are brought to Earth. There are other encouraging signs of life, too. For instance, the Curiosity rover detected a huge concentration of methane, about 21 parts per billion units of volume. This is significant because methane is formed from the emission of living organisms. This shows that the organisms were alive quite recently. Otherwise, methane would have broken down into its constituent elements. Scientists have also speculated that methane could be formed through a reaction of rock and water. Moxie, a device carried on Perseverance, may help people breathe on Mars can also help humans colonize Mars. The device helps convert carbon dioxide into oxygen by breaking it down. 
the supply of oxygen is enough for astronauts to breathe for the next 10 minutes. This device is really helpful, as it can provide a limitless supply of oxygen and can help humans stay alive on Mars. Elon Musk also wants to build a rocket, which can be refueled in space, and which will help in further space exploration. All of these indicators show that colonization of Mars is very much possible. Please share and like the video. Thank you.